Here. I didn't actually, I wasn't paying attention. I don't know what stage they picked game one. I believe it was Battlefield. Battlefield. I know, it was FD. Wow, yeah. dude. Commentator. Wow. <laughs> Dude, FD, that makes sense for Lucas, I, I believe, more than Yoshi. I think Yoshi takes more advantage of platforms right. um, than Lucas does. Lucas really prefers the flat plane so he can get really efficient PK fires off safely. Um, so that's a good pick for him. I think that's unfortunate is uh, Regolo really likes to go for these 50-50 um, you know, combos. He really likes extending his air strings, and uh, Yoshi okay. can just press the big green button out of that. Yeah, so we're not going to see much of that this set, probably. Yoshi is combo for virtually. Unless, yes. unless it's a very true, true as, true as can be combo. Um, you're Smash not getting any strings. Yeah. Unless you're, unless you're Smash 4 Bayo, you're going to have a hard time getting true combos on Yoshi. The double jump armor. Very powerful tool. I, I'm not sure what frame it activates, but it's very quick. But Lucas doesn't really have to make sure combos anymore. He used to have down throw combos in four. I believe those are gone now. Yeah, he has. He still has the grounded throw, but it's not a true grounded. Right. It's not like Rob's. Right. So not not as much he can get off that compared to other characters. Um, so really, he's just gonna be looking for, I imagine, falling uh, punishes. Yoshi doesn't have the most mix up potential when landing. He can use egg to change his momentum up a bit, but it, um, on a flat stage like this, he will have a hard time landing. A good that, PK fire there. Or, that, sorry, that PK, PK freeze. freeze is like one of the strongest moves of the game. It's actually ridiculous. Yeah, it's insane. Moves. I was watching their double set earlier when uh, Regulo and Mecha was front off the teams, and there was so much PK freeze going back and forth across the map. It was kind of kind of hard to keep track of who was who. It sends at such a linear angle, and it's so strong. That's a ridiculous move. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. I want to make it as strong as PK Flash, I guess. Well, it, I, I'd say mainly it's an edge guard. PK Flash can kill on stage better. PK Freeze, you really need to get them by the edge if you're going to kill it, yeah. unless they're Dude, high that was percent. Cool. I like that a lot. Yeah, you can get really cool resets, though, with PK Freeze and Cell there. That's, that's another thing uh, that I really enjoy about Regolo is that um, he, uh, loves making these, he loves going for the big breeds and the big rewards. And right. I think that he, that makes him such an interesting player. High risk, high reward play always the most fun to watch. And uh, he's put on quite a show for us already, though uh, we didn't mention Sunsea's awesome spike there. Uh, caught Lucas out on his upbeat. Very, very tight timing on that. It's good stuff to him. Barely lives. Yoshi is on the heavier side, of course. Oh, missed the ledge. You know he wanted the ledge there. Yeah. Um, didn't get too badly punished, though. Oh, and we saw him on the ledge. That down smash is active for so long. I think it's actually um, pretty pretty good that all three hits can kill. Because I don't think it used, all three hits used to kill. I might be wrong. I haven't seen much Lucas, so don't, don't hate me if I'm wrong there. But um, it makes it a very good edge guard tool in this game. And there's the ooh, the zero cool. plane. I really like how he delayed that third one, um, so he could fall down and get a really good true combo with the jab there. Good stuff. Very very well practiced uh, Lucas combos here. Regular's gonna be looking for this edge guard. Oh, and I guess he caught his jump. I'm not. I missed what? when that happened. I didn't see the. I didn't see the puddle. Yeah, I missed. I missed when he jumped, but um, unfortunately after Sunsea, it's gonna take a heavy loss there, going down with a two stock in game one. Not looking too good. I wonder how he's going to want to mix this up. I'd say he really wants to look for platforms if Battlefield or Yoshi's aren't banned. I'd say those would be his best two stages to go for. Um, it's my opinion. As a Yoshi expert, of course, <laughs> I play so much Yoshi. But um, that's what I would imagine he would look for. Do you play against Land and Hood? Oh, I've played a lot of Land and Hood games in my day. Uh, not in Ultimate, though. Mostly Smash 4. I did uh, run into Hood earlier today, though. It's funny, so he, he was in pull A6, and I was in pull A7. Um, so we were kind of side by side, and when pulls were first starting, he came up to me, and he's like, oh, you're in this pull too? I didn't know that. And I'm like, oh, yeah, I didn't know you were in my pull either. That's crazy. So he's like, I'm pretty sure you're not, actually. I think you're in the wrong spot. So he pulled his phone out and uh, looks at the, the pull, spot. and he's like, oh, I'm in the wrong spot. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> and just walked away real quick. So that, that was pretty funny. shout out to Hood. Um, the premier Yoshi player in four. But would you say Sunseeds has that title for NC now in Ultimate? Or is there a better Yoshi than him? I'm not sure. I feel like both these guys um, I got a lot going on outside of Smash, so they, they are right. not the most active. Gotcha. Well, it's pretty good to make it this far. Um, this is Winner's Quarter Finals. It was cool. So everyone looking to advance onto at least Winner's Semis. Has a bit of a cozier spot getting into bracket from there. So we'll see if we can do that. I love the Nair out of egg. I don't know if that was a buffer or not, but either way, it was cool. I imagine so, yeah. Ooh, left for the pretty greedy up smash there. Uh, he started earlier in the work, but just didn't have the timing for it. Sunseas is looking a little stronger here at the start of game two. Uh, did a really good job keeping even in the percent count. But interesting, he did choose to pick Smashville here. That middle platform, um, 
not as easy to get falling punches on as something like triplat. So I'm wondering if there's a ban for him, or if he just really likes smash balls. Well, that was a really good catch with that PK fire there. Does get the kill? No, not, not quite. Enough. Yeah, she's too thick. Yeah, that, his air mobility is just insane. One of the highest in the game. Uh, maybe without his jump, he can still make it quite far with that alone. Just his air mobility makes so good in combination with him being a heavy has made him so slippery in like every smash. Right, yeah, it's a, it's a really good combination to have. Even when he was at his worst, probably, I mean, Brawl was probably his worst, never played that. So, Melee, we'll say, um, still a very powerful character in the right hand. As we know, you know Amsa, of course, one of the best players in the world in Melee. But, pretty close here, going into stock two. Oh, that was such a good use of the up smash, getting the invincibility on that to go through the neutral air. Very smart course, stuff. wasn't safe on hit, so he did get... Did get the nair anyway afterwards. Yeah, but uh, probably one of the percent trades. Not yeah. too bad for him. That's the match doing crazy much more. Probably 25 or so. He was able yeah. to sit on the back. Such a great drag down with the neutral air to get the uh, reset on that combo. Really interesting stuff there. Like you were saying earlier, he really likes his resets. It's a great example there. Yeah, the drag down uh, looks here. I think it's one of the coolest things uh, Regula does. And just a random forward smash. Yeah, I feel stage. like the egg roll was unintentional there, and he's <laughs> kind of trying to hit that back. But, right. You know, he's got the percent rate to go for stuff like that. Will this? Not quite. And he will get that, I believe. No, oh, great, great timing. Yeah. Great timing. I that messed was... that up so much. I'm impressed. <laughs> it's, it's really hard. You have to be really close against that down smash. It's very active. And I like the edge. Help him get back on stage. Uh, he's going to step out that forward air to the stock. Yeah, caught him on the platform. So what? Um, something Yoshi was looking to do, but hasn't made too much good use of that platform yet. This match. Regular doing a good job landing. I love the falling up there into neutral layer knowing that he's going to drop shield. I wonder if I'm, I wonder if he narrowed out a shield too much stuff. Hard to say. Oh, kind of got caught there. I thought, thought he might um, get hit with the last of the nair, so just ran into him. Get a small punish. Off stage now, since he's looking, she had an edge guard. Ooh, the down smash is a little questionable. Does that, do you know if that can two frame? It does two frame, but it was, uh, it was not, um, it was a very, uh, very risky option. Which is so high percent, I feel like you could, you could have done something uh, less mm -hmm. risky and got the stock. Makes sense to me. Um, it does not get a big reward. Oh, and oh, that, I love that. That was so active. Wow. Like yeah, good stuff. He really went to go off stage for neutral, and that probably would have killed. Okay, we'll get the back air there. Yoshi's back air. Um, Very one, strong. One of the strongest buff moves in the transition from Ford Ultimate. It got buff. Wow, I didn't know that. Oh, yeah, it, it really didn't kill that well in Ford for sure. Um, it's a very strong kill move now. Okay, good movement there from Sunseeds. Dancing around Regular's options. Regular playing quite aggressive. Um, Sunseeds should be able to make it back here. No, very. Uh... That was really. That was so fast. Get the air dodge back on stage and that smash up. Yeah. What's uh, the drag on New Shore? Just the back throw? Not as strong. Yeah, Yoshi a little too heavy for that, but still almost got the kill. Let's trap scenario. We'll be able to roll on. And yet Sunseeds betting it all there. Oh, yeah, that air dodge, a little questionable. I did, I did like that idea from Sunseeds, though. Like, I, I think going off stage was fine, but I do think he could have just up to make it back to the ledge. The air dodge is a lot more punishable because there's no ledge snap there. Um, but good stuff to Regulo, winning 2-0.